Before we connect the printer to the router, please go to your router and check if your router comes with this WPS button or not. Once you have confirmed your router comes with the WPS button and you know how to enable it, once you have checked your router comes with the WPS mode, then you can use this method to connect the printer to the wireless router. First, Go to the printer and look for the network button. Press and hold the network button until the LCD screen here flashing. After you have activated the printer's WPS mode, go to your wireless router and activate the WPS mode as well. For my case, I will need to press and hold the WPS button until the Wi-Fi icon here flashing. Now, the wireless router is flashing. It will start to establish the connection between the printer and the router together. This whole process will request to complete within 120 seconds. This is the default. Once the printer has established the connection, you will see the printer. You can see on the LCD display here, the Wi-Fi icon comes together with the signal bar. So, for the printer here, if it shows 3 bars, which means the Wi-Fi signal is very strong, very strong connection between the router and also with the printer. If let's say it's 2, which means the signal is just average. And if just 1, I will ask you to put the printer closer to your wireless router. So, you can see now the printer is already connected to the wireless router using the WPS mode connection. If let's say your Wi-Fi router does not come together with the WPS button, what you can do is you need to get ready of your mobile phone and install the Canon Cleanups to your mobile phone for the Wi-Fi connections. I will show you how to do this step. On my phone, I have already downloaded the Canon Print Apps over here. So, what I need to do is I go to the printer, look for the direct button, press and hold the direct button until the LCD screen flashing here. Once it flashes, go to your iPhone, go to your iPhone or your Android phone, then go to the Wi Fi on your mobile phone. Wi-Fi. After that, select the Canon IJ G3010 series printer Wi-Fi. This is a Wi-Fi that does not require any Wi-Fi password. Just select and connect to the Wi-Fi. Once it is connected, go back to the Canon Print S. Go to your Canon Print S. Click and open it. Then. Go to the top left side, select the app printer. Once you have selected it, it will automatically come up with this message. My setup preparation are complete and asking you to connect the uh, printer. Just press OK. Then the mobile phone will display all the wireless router near to this printer. Select the Wi-Fi router that you want to connect. For my case, I want to connect the printer to the U-Mobile. Select the U-Mobile and then it will ask you to key the Wi-Fi router password. So, I just need to key according to my wireless router here. This is my wireless router Wi-Fi password. So, key in to the mobile phone. Once you have key in the Wi-Fi password for your router, press OK. Now, the apps will send the Wi-Fi password to the printer so that the printer can connect it to the wireless router using the password that you have key in. It will take some time. 
One is stop flashing. You can check the Wi-Fi icon here. It comes up with the same icon that I introduced earlier where it comes with the signal bar. Once the signal bar is appear, which means the printer already connected to the wireless router here. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.